Hi, I hope you're having an amazing day. As you saw from the title of this video, today we're going to be doing my October Shaw My Stash. So basically, this is where I keep my Shaw My Stash products in this little four containers up here on the top. All of the rest are my liquid lipsticks. So we're going to go ahead and go through the products that I used last month for September. We're going to go through my collection. We're going to pick out some new products and we're going to start off the new month with new makeup. So if you want to see my thoughts on last month's products and the products that I choose for the next month of October, just keep on watching. <laughs> all right so we're just going to start off on the bottom drawer so first off we have my nsns powder this is basically a powder that i really love and you guys have seen it in action many times before this one here is in the shade 02 love this this is from timu and i already have one on the way to me from the site i did repurchase because i'm almost through this one so really love this and so happy that i pulled it this month we do have a couple of other products in here we have the LA colors bronzer honestly this shade is just a little too light for me so i didn't really reach for it as often but you know i always love LA colors they're my favorite brand this one here is in beach babe really love their products but this one's just a little too light which is why i didn't really reach for it as often instead i was reaching for my face palette which is on the bottom the city color contour fix palette i have like a couple of different options in here we have two different colors in here so i really uh, love that middle shade instead so loved these two reach for the city color more pixie by petra highlight you guys know i love this and i reach for it a lot we also have my b color no my b pure essentially ageless blush and this is just an orangey shade this was so beautiful loved it in this next drawer we have my ella color truly matte foundation i'm kind of sad i didn't get to finish this up honestly there's like a little bit left everything is stuck on the side so i am gonna keep it in my collection and try to use it up completely i don't want to just toss it out because this is actually a really great foundation it doesn't last as great on my skin type but honestly i really love it so i'm gonna go ahead and keep it a little longer I also did film a full face of LA Colors, so if it's up on my channel already, I'll have it down below. This is the LA Colors Ultimate Cover Concealer. Really love this as well. This one here is in the shade Natural alongside my Peach Color Corrector. Girl, yes, love. Setting spray of the month was the Poudier Fix Plus Matte Setting Spray. Loved this. As you can see, I really went through it this month, so I'm almost through this product i just really enjoyed it so when this is finally out of my collection i'm definitely going to repurchase i really enjoyed this product completely forgot about this product i wasn't really reaching for it the be pure infused press powder as you can see i hit pan on it i end up debating whether i want to throw it in my empties it's just like a little tiny bit left um i don't think so let's keep it in the collection a little longer all right next drawer we have here which honestly just reminded me so this is basically where i'm keeping my fun drawer I literally forgot to pull from here um, earlier, so we're just going to leave it like it is. But we do have a fun kind of product here, the AOS Studio Loose Pigment. I love this product. I did use it in my Get Ready With Me. Didn't really use it throughout the month, but I really love this color in the shade Spell. Definitely recommend these. We have my Young Vision Liquid Blush. This is a dupe for the She Glam blushes on the site. But this one is from Timu in the shade 101 Love Cake. Really love this. Didn't really reach for it as often, to be honest. I don't know why. But it's actually really good and really pigmented as well. Really love that this product... We had another Timu product. We have the IBCCC NDC Power Grip Primer. Love this. You guys know I used it a lot alongside the e.l.f. Liquid Poreless Primer. Both of them are amazing. Last two products in this drawer are from Timu. These are the Lake Rain Liquid um, products. So we have a bronzer and a highlight. Really love these. You guys know I literally include them in a lot of videos, especially in Timu videos on my Instagram and everything. So I really love these two as well. Let's see we have one more drawer here. So on the top drawer, we have a lipstick from the Physician's Formula. And this is the one in, I hate Mondays, I think it's called. Yes, I don't like Mondays. This one's cute. I used it a handful of times, I think. Mixed it with the dark brown lip liner. Really like it. Not really the biggest fan of the color, but I thought it was a cute formula. Next, we had two mascaras. We had the Poudier Sky High Mascara. Love it. We also have the Kaja. Honestly, I really like this one. It's just a little clumpy vibe. So I don't know. I was reaching for it um, in the beginning of the month. And then I just kind of stopped towards the end. Um, because I noticed that it's very clumpy vibes. But also the formula itself is very wet. So it kind of transferred a lot. So that's my only gripe with it. But other than that, it's really nice. Really black. And I love that it comes with 3-in-1 kind of moments. Cute. We have the 
Cut a story the brow glue to be honest i was using another brow glue the whole month i don't know why i didn't reach for this we also had the free Paulo um and she glam collection one so good and also my eye method from timu both of them are amazing products so i had a lip gloss from la colors this is their juicy lip gloss i did use this quite a few times really love it so beautiful so shimmery love their um lip glosses we also had the ioni cosmetics fat chubby eye pencil a good this la colors gel eyeliner you guys know artista liner i love ebony new york i love so F oh i forgot about this aoa pseudo slim brow was in here yeah all of this i love kaja beauty liner was amazing also did use this beauty bay one on instagram so love everything else so i'm gonna go ahead and put these back and then we're gonna go into my collection we're gonna choose a new makeup for the month of october which is definitely gonna be more on the halloweeny bluey kind of side and then we're gonna come back and put everything back in these drawers completely forgot to mention that i also had the full fantasy lunar beauty and lower league collaboration this month i definitely used it maybe a handful of times there's a look at the color story i'll have the few um instagram and reels and such that i filmed using this throughout the week for work but yeah this is such a beautiful palette definitely recommend if you're into these kind of colors definitely pick it up it's so worth it guys so we're gonna look through my drawers i already have a palette in mind let me fix you guys hold on all right that's better so i, I already have a palette in mind i am thinking i'm gonna stick to more she glam base since this is um, my october pulling i do want something that's more catered to like halloweeny vibes i think last year i pulled my wretched romance from she glam so i don't want to pull it this time around i did do a video recently using that palette as well so that's on my channel but i do want to go ahead and pull the corpse bride and she glam collection you guys know this palette this is a stunning such a beautiful color story so i'm gonna go ahead and pull this this one's definitely more catered to like the blue kind of tones um, kind of vibes it's really nice so i'm gonna go ahead and pull this palette for the month all right so this is where i keep my show my stash makeup so we're gonna move down here we have some liquid lipsticks in here i did go ahead and kind of move around my makeup collection not sure if i showed you guys last month but let's see what kind of colors i want to go for this month um so these are like where my deep tones kind of are we have like a purple we have my villains color there I really do want to pull the Amuse Birthday Suit Liquid Lipstick. This one here is in the shade Lace. So I'm going to go ahead and pull that. And I also want something more on the nude side. So I'm going to go back up here. This is where my nude liquid lipsticks are. And I'm going to pull the She Glam Liquid Lipstick in the shade Bougie. Yeah, love this one as well. Before I forget, I'm going to go ahead and pull a setting spray. I'm really feeling this setting spray from Revolution, their Sports Fix setting spray. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this. So I do have my mascaras back there, my uh, pencil liners, and my liquid liners. We also have my lip liners here and my brow pencils. So for sure, like brow products, girl, I already know what I want. Believe it or not, these two were not in my Shot My Sash last month. I was just using them nonstop because I love them. Brownination from Be Bella and my She Glam 2 in 1 brow pencil. So I'm going to go ahead and pull these two officially for this month. The lip liner from Ebony York, I believe, was also not in my Shot My Sash. So I'm going to pull that as well for the month. I love it. All right, and now we can get into this section. So we do have my mascaras here. I really do want to officially pull the 2 in 1 mascara from She Glam. This is one of my favorites. This is the non waterproof. Ooh. I'm really feeling the AOS Studio Eyes on Me Vivid Liquid Liner. This one here is in the shade O Lala. Oh, it's so small because I use it all the time. This LA Colors Neon Gel Liner Hypnotic. I'm going to go ahead and pull that. Taking the LA Colors Gel Eyeliner in the shade Mermaid Tail Shimmer. I have this one from AOS Studio, their Artista Liquid Liner. I'm going to go ahead and pull this in blue. I also do want something for when I'm not feeling quite blue vibes um maybe something just like black i i don't want to use this one a little more the aoa studio liquid liner this is just their like rainbow one so i'm gonna pull that as well just notice i didn't have my flash on so annoying but here we go the flash just helps the light reflect a little better now you guys can see everything in full color so this is my drawer where i keep all my um, lip balms and such so i do already have an idea of what i want for my lips oh it's like right on the top i'm gonna go ahead and pull the she glam corpse bride lip balm that goes along with that collection i have my liquid products here i think i'm just gonna pull my she glam fave so the um sun sculpt liquid bronzer we have my blushes we have two highlights i kind of want to see which one i want to pull kind of want the one that's more glimmery this one here in hibiscus i'm gonna go ahead and pull this and for blush 
I have three different colors. All right, and I think I'm gonna go for the brighter one, which is in the shade Gold Quartz. These are gonna be my three liquid products for the month. All right, next we have my next two drawers. We have my primers on this one and my highlights over here. So for primer, I do have my She Glam primers right here. I think I'm gonna pull my Birthday Skin Primer. You guys know, you guys have seen this before. I literally used it recently in my full face of She Glam. I'm gonna go ahead and pull that. And also I do wanna stick to more bluey tones. Um, I do have these two Coco Kind products. They're basically like skincare kind of vibes. This is a SPF. And then we have their eye cream as well. So I'm just going to pull them just so I can use them a little more. And start incorporating them in my uh, my like uh, routine a little more. So I'm going to go ahead and pull these two as well. Alright, I think I'm just going to pull the Ulta Beauty Cool Committee Face Primer. And this is basically a cooling jelly face primer. Then for highlight, we do have this section. I know I have a highlight from the Corpse Bride collection, which is right here. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this as well. It's just part of that same collection. And there's a look at that. Super cute. All right, next two drawers are my foundations and my blushes, concealers, and all of that. So to be honest, I have really been into my e.l.f., but I need to stop using it because I'm almost out and I don't want to repurchase, repurchase it quite yet. So obviously, I'm going to stick to She Glam. Um, we are taking the She Glam Complexion Pro, and I think I'm just going to take my She Glam um, Concealer in the shade Coconut Flakes as well. I have my blushes. Let's see. I do have some She Glam blushes in here. Uh, where are they? Oh, I have this one here. We also have this one, which is more on the putty side. Um... But honestly, I don't really feel those. So I think I'm going to take this Ioni Cosmetics Creature Blush instead. It's a nice, like, neutral kind of tone. And this is, again, just their Sea Rose color. All right, these two drawers, I have my lipsticks and I have my um, bronzers. So why don't we start off with bronzers? I have my She Glam bronzer, the Sunside one in the shade Sunset Walk. You guys know this is a favorite. Or lipsticks why not let's take the she glam lipstick in the shade don't hesitate yeah love this thing so i'm gonna go ahead and pull this all right next drawers should be a little easier since i already know what i want for my powders these are two of my favorite powders from she glam their pressed powder foundation in the shade honey and also their velvet veil pressed powder i love these two so i'm gonna go ahead and pull these as for lip gloss we do have this one here which is their love dive lip gloss in the shade blue over you goes great with the collection and the blue theme so i think this is the only lip gloss that i'll be pulling this month I do have some face palettes honestly i'm not really feeling face palettes this month we have this glitch out palette but i literally never reach for it it's very different why not let's go ahead and pull this as well just so i can try to use this That was not the most aesthetic kind of vibe honestly because i was holding the camera so i was kind of shaking and stuff but i made everything fit in the four drawers definitely hope you guys enjoyed watching let me know what was your favorite product that i chose have you tried any of them do you love them do you hate them the next upload will be me throwing all of this makeup on my face so definitely stick around subscribe so you can watch that i do have a whole playlist which is always linked down below so if you want to see that definitely check that out don't forget to like and subscribe before you leave and i'll see you guys in the next one bye <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,